guys. Wasn't gonna do a video today and then I decided to do a short one just because it's September 3rd and September is National Suicide Prevention and Awareness Month. So I know that several of you out there who suffer from anxiety, depression, PTSD, OCD, any kind of mental illness um, have had thoughts of possibly ending your life, feeling like you're a burden, feeling like other people would be better without you. And um, I posted about this in the Anxiety Warriors Facebook group, if you wanna go and join that group. I also posted on the Fear Itself Facebook page. Um, a very interesting selection of famous people, um, historical figures, and people who are part of pop, pop culture now who tried to kill themselves before they became famous. And it was people like Oprah, Billy Joel, um, Martin Luther King Jr. I, I know, that one shocked me. A long list of people, and they're not even, it's not a comprehensive list, it's just a, a sampling, a smattering that I put together. These are all people who, at one time or another, were in the pit of despair. They were all the way down at the bottom. They had hit rock bottom and they thought, I have nothing to give the world. I am not worth anything. I have nothing to offer. And for some of you, and myself included, we're familiar with that, those thoughts and we're familiar with those feelings and really, really thinking that that is true. And each of these people on this list that I shared had, before they became what they would later become, Walt Disney was on there, um, attempted suicide. And I asked you, I'm asking you now, to consider what our culture what our history, what our present, what our future would be without these people's contributions, without Beethoven's music, without Walt Disney, without Oprah, without Martin Luther King Jr., without um, people like Ronda Rousey, who, you know, it's a list that some of these are like major world changers and, and some of them you may roll your eyes out, but I, I ro not don't roll your eyes out. You may roll your eyes out, but, for me, I, I tried to choose people who made a difference, made an impact. Um, Tina Turner's on the list. People who changed the industry that they're in, um, opened doors, um, improved Martin Luther King Jr. Of course, we all know the massive impact he's had on us as a people, as a world, right? Um, imagine if he had been successful in his attempt and so none of, none of the civil rights things that he contributed to, none of his speeches, none of what he did after would be a part of our truth and our history now. What would that have meant for us as a, as a society, as humanity, as a world? I'm so glad that he was unsuccessful. I'm so glad that Billy Joel was unsuccessful. I love his music. He brought piano music to pop. He, he did incredible things. He does incredible things. Walt Disney, Mickey Mouse, are you kidding? Walt Disney World? What if there was no Walt Disney World? Disney, cartoons, animation, movies. All of these people did these major, major things. They, they came out of their pit of despair and went on to create, to inspire, <laughs> to make massive change in their industry and in the world. And if they had been successful at their attempt to, to take their own lives, none of what we have because of them would be um, available to us. And I'm rambling now, but, but Robin Williams used to say a thing, and it's something that I keep in my heart. And he said, don't die with the music still in you. Of course I get emotional, I get choked up with that because I believe very strongly with my whole heart that every person on this planet is here for a reason. You have a purpose, you have a mission, you've been created to do something, to give something, to contribute, to share, to improve, to heal, something that only you can do in the way that only you can do it. And if you haven't found what that is yet, that's okay. Just know that it is true about you the same as it's true about everybody else. And I know that it's hard to believe sometimes and I know that it's much easier to believe those negative thoughts about yourself that because I haven't seen it yet or I haven't made it yet, it hasn't happened for me yet, maybe it's not supposed to happen. I know that that's easier to believe. It's also a cop out. It's a lie and it's an excuse to lie down. 
I'm not being ugly. If you've had those thoughts, I've had those thoughts too, and they feel true in the moment, and you don't want to be a burden to anybody, and I want you to know today that you're not a burden. You are an absolute treasure. You are loved, and you are so valued. And if you feel today like there's nobody in your life that loves you, I love you. I love you so much. And I cannot wait to see the thing that you give to this world because you decided to stay here. If you are having thoughts of taking your own life, if you are feeling hopeless and desperate today, I want you to call the, the number that's listed below or text the number. If you don't like stock on the phone, they have a text option as well and speak to somebody who can help you. Okay? If you need immediate assistance, I'm putting all the information in the box below. Don't die with the music still in you. You're here for a reason. You're important to all of us. We need you. We are less without you. We are more with you. I love you. I hope that you have a fantastic, awesome day and that something surprisingly awesome happens for you today. Live in courage. I love you so much. Bye-bye.